Hi guys, and welcome back to Creative Glam. My name is Sharon. If you're new to my channel, hello and welcome. I'm so glad you stopped by, and if you're returning, thank you and welcome back. Make sure you hit the subscribe button below, along with that notification bell. Hit the notification bell twice, so that you don't miss out on any of my future videos. I hope you enjoy the way this project turns out as much as I did. And I would love it if you would take a moment to leave me a comment or just say hello. I would also love it if you took a moment to give me a big thumbs up. Today on Creative Glam, I'm going to share with you my annual raised bed, herb, and veggie garden. Let me show you what we did. Let's get started. Here my husband is adding the organic raised bed potting soil into our little planter. Uh, as you can see, it is well used. We create this uh, herb and veggie garden every year. Most of the herbs and veggies that we use are for salads, but of course everything is for cooking. Here he's gonna smooth out the dirt uh, and prepare to place the plants. He's laying out the, the herbs and veggies that he purchased from Home Depot that we're gonna plant today. And here is where he describes he leaves a spot in the center of the planter. He's going to plant some oregano later because oregano helps to uh, repel certain pests. And these are the cherry tomatoes. First, you dig a hole. Then you remove the herb from the pot. And then you wanna loosen up the roots just a little bit. Then you place the plant inside and cover it back up with the organic soil. And these are the chives. And he's gonna repeat the same process. Again, he's loosening the root ball. And placing it in the soil. And then here's the basil, that's my favorite. And again, we're gonna repeat the same process throughout.
And here's the flat leaf parsley. And here's the rosemary, which is his favorite herb. Here is where he talks about why he put the rosemary in the back I because the it spreads out and takes up a lot of real really estate. Really grows and it can take over a lot of the area. So I wanted a way as much, uh, I wanted a, away from the uh, other plants as much. It's really windy out here and I know you can't hear because the wind is blowing and my microphone wasn't on and I wasn't even aware of that until now. Last but not least are the bell peppers. I cook with those often. Now he's gonna add a little bit more soil, a little more topsoil to make sure they're good and covered. And last but not least, he's gonna water the herb garden. And then after he adds the water, And here he's just moving the herbs around and reshaping them and making sure they're sitting where they need to be and making sure the plants have enough space in between, uh, in between them to grow properly. Okay guys, that's it. We're all done. We like how it turned out. What do you think? If you enjoyed it too, let me know in the comments below. I appreciate you being here and I would love it if you gave me a big thumbs up. Make sure you hit that subscribe button below along with the notification bell. Hit that notification bell twice 
so that you don't miss out on any future videos. I have other videos linked in the description box below. Be sure and check them out. And also check out my second channel, Creative Glam Crafts. I've left a link to that channel below as well. And with that being said, have a blessed day. And I'll see you next time on Creative Glam. Happy gardening. Bye.